In this module, I'm going to go over the theme we are using for the rest of this project in this class. Um, it is a required theme in order for you to be able to follow along and do all of the steps that I give to you. Um, it, it is going to be something that you will have to purchase. Uh, you can purchase it from Elegant Themes for $69 a year membership, or you can purchase the theme direct from us for $15. So the theme we're using is actually Divi. It is an ultimate drag and drop page builder. Um, it's very, very effective. It's got a bunch of different content elements, pre-made layouts. Uh, it's extremely easy to use even for a novice WordPress user. So it will actually help you create some very stunning designs in a very fast amount of time without any type of design knowledge or, or coding experience required. So that's one of the reasons that we're using this. Uh, when you click over to actually purchase the theme from us, as well as the page builder, I have linked it to a demo so that you can see exactly how it works. It's just very simple drag and drop editing. Um, and you can actually play with this demo without fear of messing anything up on your own site. So without further ado, I'm going to show you how we're going to upload this and the page builder and install it. In this section, you're going to go to your WordPress dashboard and upload both the Divi theme and the page builder. And I'm going to show you how easy this is to do. Over here on your left-hand menu side, you're just going to go over and click on Appearance. And then you'll see the current themes that are activated on your WordPress site. These come as the default themes. Since we're not using these, the first thing I would advise you to do is delete the themes that you're not using. Now that said, you cannot delete any of the, you can't delete any active theme, but what you can do is now get ready to upload the Divi theme to your WordPress site. So all you do is click on that and then upload theme. You're going to choose the file that you saved to your computer earlier. And the easiest way to do this is go here. Here's the Divi theme. It, differentiated by Divi and Divi Dash Builder. So you're going to upload that Divi theme onto your WordPress site. And then you're going to click the activate button. Now your Divi theme is activated so you can delete this other theme that was already pre-installed on your site so that everything is nice and clean and pretty and fresh and new. The next thing we're going to do is actually upload the Divi Page Builder plugin. The way you're going to do this is simply go into your plugins menu, scroll here to add new, and this is going to follow a lot the same format as what just happened when we uploaded your theme to your WordPress site. So all you're going to do is go up here at the top and click the upload plugin button you're going to select the file that you want to upload, which is going to be the Divi Builder. Then you're just going to click on that zip file, hit open, and then install now. And then once this is installed, it will follow the exact same process as activating a theme. You're just simply going to click Activate Plugin. And ta-da, you are all set with your theme and your plugin. And the next thing we're going to go over in the next module is how to begin customizing this uh, to suit the needs of your unique website.